welcome back to a brand new video guys. I seriously miss you guys I seriously do apologize for not uploading any videos for 10 days I seriously, you know was trying my best to actually get stuff done in real life And hopefully you guys do understand where I'm coming from with this, but it's not your guys fault at all All right, so don't blame it on yourself. I love doing YouTube right right now I'm just struggling to get back, but I'll promise you guys I will be back next week because you know what I've been uploading a video for 10 days guys That is seriously not good and I also did reach the 40,000 subscribers and I just went so inactive after that it's just like no joke guys I seriously need to come back on YouTube but first off I'm trying to get stuff done in real life as soon as possible straighten it up before I start doing YouTube so I don't have any other conflicts in the future but besides that guys today we're gonna be talking about the brand new 2.12 update which is also known as the blackest night Halloween update for injustice gods among us mobile so first off I want to let you guys know that this update is not that big because there's only one new character added into Injustice Gods Among Us, and we're be we're gonna be expecting this character to come up anytime soon because Halloween is coming up. So I'm not really sure if there's gonna be any new characters in the future because this update kind of seems a little bit short. I'm be honest, right? <laughs> this update does seem a little bit short because there's only one new character and one new legendary cure, which is belonging to the character Scarecrow. Now, does this mean that there's gonna be the character Scarecrow added to the game? I actually was planning the SMC on Scarecrow this uh, month. I'm not sure if I'm gonna continue on it, but basically guys um scarecrow we're probably not gonna see the character enchantress coming up as a character in injustice anytime soon but it's kind of good that injustice kind of heard the players out instead of you know they couldn't really give us the character it's completely understandable but hopefully he's safe for injustice too maybe but at least they gave us the gear but moving on guys so the game icon has changed it's no longer the suicide squad update so definitely the icon should change and we're not going to be expecting any suicide squad things to come out anytime soon anymore so the next thing we have is is the revamped Blackest Night Batman. So they basically enhanced the Blackest Night Batman so much, guys, even including his stats. Now let's just compare the old Batman to the newest one. We'll have a more in-depth um, comparison in the future. So for now, so the older version had an ability called Night Strength, and it stated that the Blackest Night gains 20% damage between midnight and sunrise. Now, to be honest with you guys, his ability was trash because it's just weird because it's just no, it's just not that good. But you know, the only way you could actually, you know, play this during the day was just to go to your settings and change your time to like midnight, and that would have just affected your game as entirely. But who cared in the end? But that's the only way you could have activated his ability unless you just wanted to stay awake at night late which I would never do because I love my sleep also his starting stats were 800 for his health and 1000 for his damage pretty low stats for a gold character but now let's just take a look at the newest blackest night Batman revamped version so this guy starts off with 1400 for his strength and 1600 for his health so his stats have increased so much guys starting stats compared to the older version and moving on to his passive which is now called surging darkness and the description states that Batman deals more damage as his opponent health depletes. Blackest Night characters receive an additional 10% unblockable chance for each character member on their team. So that's about 30% chance in total if you guys pair the whole team up with Blackest Night characters. Also, if you guys have any gears that you guys know that are best for certain characters for the Blackest Night team, let me know in the comment section below, guys. That would be really helpful. But besides that, guys, moving on, we're going to be talking about Blackest Night Hawkgirl, which is the newest character in this update and the only newest character. Also, guys, I do want to apologize for not having any certain gameplay on this new character. It's just because the update is not out on iOS yet. It's only on iAndroid. And I usually do make gameplay on iOS, so my screen recorder wouldn't capture anything on Android because it only supports iOS. So with that being said, guys, the review will be tomorrow. For you guys who are questioning right now, K9, when will be the update for iOS? It's highly expected tomorrow because Injustice usually gets the updates on Thursdays. So if it's not tomorrow, then it has to be. I don't know what is Injustice doing then? It has to be tomorrow. There's no other question about that. But going back, talking about the character Blackest Night, Hawkgirl. So this character, I've heard rumors out here that her ability basically for every um, Blackest Night character on her team that dies comes back with 20% health now this is so amazing guys this just makes me want to make a resurrection team filled with her then a blackest night character which is paired up with um one gear that also does resurrection that's two times resurrection on the same character that would be so amazing guys 
So with that being said, that's that, and I will be reviewing this character tomorrow as soon as possible, as soon as the update drops on iOS. I got you guys, alright? Anytime there's a new update, I got you guys, alright? And also goes along with the gear as well, the Scarecrow's mask, and when I'll have the chance to review it, I will. That wraps up today's video, guys. That wraps up the update in general. This is a really short update celebrating Halloween, of course. Hopefully you guys all have a great Halloween, and yeah, basically that's it, guys. I'll see you guys tomorrow. It is your boy, K9 unit and i'm out love you guys peace